Ni hao, howdy folks. So I've got two identical wallets here. One's a Chinese made seeker and one's the American Trevax. So I thought I'd do a quick comparison on them and first impressions. Just got them both today. Haven't even looked at them yet. So I'm gonna carry the Chinese one for two weeks and then the American one for two weeks and at the end of the month I'll see which one I like the best. They both look pretty much identical on the photos, so let's have a quick look. Here's a Chinese one wrapped up in a bag. There she is. Stainless steel frame. Real leather. Not sure what the card capacity is on it. Leather feels pretty soft. Not too thin, but thin. Let's see what the American Trailax is like. There she is. Got it in sexy tobacco brown. Same thing, steel frame. Really thick leather. Looks nice. Paracord on the Trevax. Nothing on the Seeker. Got a rivet on the Trevax and just a straight piece of metal on the Seeker. Both got cap lifters in the same place. Both the same size, same thickness, height. Steel frames look the same thickness as well. Call it two and a half mil thick on the Seeker. About the same on the Trevax. And the leather on the Trevax is going to be different because it's real leather, so it's a natural material. Call it two and a half mil thick. And the Seeker, call it one and a half mil thick. And they've both got money clips. Two cards with a tree box. I just mad about taking it out. See the money clip on the tree box is off to the side. Centered on the Chinese one. Chinese one's just screwed into the frame. And that one looks like it's not bolted in. I thought those were rivets there, but it just melted ends off of the paracord. Feels really good thick leather on the Trevax. It's a little easy to come undone on the Trevax, but I'll see what it's like when it's under tension, when it's got cords and things in it. And the Chinese one's just got the traditional pressed studs. Put it back for a second. So they're good and solid. So I carry four cords and I like to carry some cash. Can't remember what the specs are as far as the capacity goes. But for the Trevax it is 
three cords, three to ten cords and one to five bills. So we're four, four bills, make it five, did see four, did it? One to five bills, so there's five. And four cords. It's going to need a uh, stretching a little bit, I think. Nope, it's fine. So there's the cords in, I've got four in there. Five bills. And this is uh, obviously British pounds. These are made out of uh, polymer plastic. And I think the Americans are still using the. Uh, paper so yeah it's made more for the American dollars than British ones does fit in there though but and that's not gonna close it'll need stretching I think well, it's not going to fit five pounds in there. I'll try three. I'm going to have to stretch this uh, leather anyway. It'll stretch naturally, or you can just put soak it in water and stretch it around the cords but uh yeah it's not gonna take all of them out yeah it's the cords that's doing it it needs to be uh formed around the cords to get it to work so i'll do that some other time but uh as far as the seeker goes. Four cords are in. Still loads of space. I think to adjust this one with it just being screwed in, I'll have to undo the screws, put some more holes in the leather and then move it across a bit. Actually, no, I don't. I just pull this through. And there you go. Nicely fits now. So I'll try that with the. Uh, I don't know what the capacity is on the Chinese one, but there's the five. Is it? Four. Five notes. Actually, you don't have to fold them like that, do you? Fold them in half and then stick them like that. Then I can fold them in half using that. There you go. Fits. That looks alright. I'll have to stretch this one out. I can just stick cards in this and it'll stretch out stretch out naturally. Or maybe if I pull this through. No, that won't work because it'll make the bit shorter. So I'll have to stretch this one out. I'll either just stick the cords in and let it stretch out naturally, or I'll try and wet form it. But the uh, Chinese one looks good, fits, and they're both identical pretty much. Studs are different, frames are slightly different, money clips different. Same height, width, and all of that. So I'll carry this one for two weeks, and then I'll try the uh, Trivax out and see which one I like better. So I did get the cards in. I just moved this and pushed it through slightly to create some more room, and they went in just fine. It's still a little bit of a tight fit. 
but I'm going to leave uh, some fake cords in here and just let the leather stretch itself out instead of wet forming it. And the clip is now nice and secure. It's not going to go anywhere. And I've got five bills in there as well. So, yeah. Just want to carry the Chinese one for uh, two weeks and... This one, like I say, for two weeks after that, and then at the end of the month, I'll see which one I like best. So, 65 year warranty, and I think this one's got a three year warranty on it. So, that's my real little quick first impressions. Both wallets are very good. Chinese won't surprise me at how good it is. The leather feels a little bit thin, it's not too thin though, it's soft, so we'll see how that performs over the next two weeks. And like I say, I'll just see which one I like at the end of the month. So that's them, thanks for watching.